Hello everybody, my name is Ross and Person. Welcome back to another video. This video is going to be a little different from what I usually do. Today, in this video, I will be showing you guys how to get Plants vs. Zombies 3 on your iPhones. Now, before we get into it, I'm going to show you on the App Store. I'm on my normal Apple ID account. PVZ3. Oh, PVZ3 will not be available. As you see, it's just PVZ2, PVZ, PVZ Heroes, the comics, etc. It's not available. So what you have to do in order to get Plants vs. Zombies 3 begins with you going into your settings. In step one, you must log out of your Apple ID account. As I am currently logging out, I'm going to get into the next step. With the next step, you have to create a new Apple ID account. Don't have an Apple ID or forgot it, you will have to press that and you will press create Apple ID. You will need to research a postal code, a post, a postal code from the Philippines, which won't be too hard. And once you do that, you can everything else you can do on your own, your address, your city, etc. You can do that all on your own, but you will need a postal code from the Philippines. Now, I've already made an account, so I'm just going to use that. Apple ID. This is what I put it as. Sorry, this is what I put it as. Couldn't think of a name, and that was easy to remember, so I just put it as that. Now, I click Next, and then... You put in a password. Now, to go into further detail, for iOS, you create an Apple ID. To make it easier upon yourself, may also make it a Google account, so you can verify your email easier using Google and Gmail. You, so you download Gmail, and then you add your new Apple ID slash Google account so you receive emails from the email you are using for this tutorial to get PVZ3 because you will have to verify your email and you will receive an email to verify it'll be a six digit code now let's move forward you will just need to put in a code put in whatever It might also be your iPhone code. Click merge or don't merge, it doesn't matter. I'm just going to click merge. As you see, I've already created an account, so this is my new Apple ID account. Once you do that, you want to exit settings and open App Store. Once you've opened App Store, you will need to press on the icon at the top right, the blue circle with the little blue circle inside and another half circle. Once you've signed in, it will take you to a similar page like this. It will ask you to put in your country slash region for the new Apple ID account you just created. But since I've already created this one, it will be a bit different for me, but basically it's a similar, it's the same process. All you have to do is go to your country slash region. Alright. Now for me it'll say change country and region. For you it'll say something like just add country, region, whatever. But it doesn't matter. It's, just, it's the same process. Just different because I've already created this account. But basically you want to scroll down to Philippines. As you see I already have it on. Because this is the country that the game is in. And once you do that you're good to go and you search plants vs zombies 3 or pvz 3 oh my god I can't type and it should pop up right here the first thing to pop up you, you can tap on it and download it on tap on open but for you it'll say get because I already have it downloaded 
but in order to download it you will have to verify your email that you've used for your new Apple ID account this is why I suggested to make a Google account as it is easier to operate in my opinion for receiving emails and entering codes to verify the email once you've verified your email you will be able to download it and it works and it runs perfectly and smoothly no, no problems whatsoever and once you've got it downloaded you can switch back to your account switching back to my main account I'll be back once I've switched again you have to type in the code you have for your iPhone or whatever code merge or don't merge I go with merge so I don't mess anything up or what not so I don't lose anything I have on my phone and then there you go you switch back to your account and you still have PVZ3 it won't be in the store but you will have it downloaded and you will be able to use it without any problems whatsoever watch it's not going to be in the store anymore I am not sure if you can update the game but I am sure that you can play it. Now, without further ado, I'm pretty sure I've covered everything you need to know to get PVZ3. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I hope that this tutorial helped you guys out. When some others didn't explain that you had to verify your email in order to actually download it. So I hope this actually helps more than lol anyways I apologize for using the word lol that was cringe but anyways I hope you guys joined I hope this helped if it did please leave a like and I would really appreciate it if you guys subscribe to my channel as yes it does help me out I will see you all in the next video